hello guys so in today's video actually i will be talking about uh, this step topography you know i do have this project and i do have a little topography in here let me even uh, show you the the side of it this is actually the site and i do have this little topography um, in it actually the height in here approximately three meters and then this one if i consider it as zero okay which is say the street level and then this little topography so um I, I tried to create it using the topography normal normal command from the massing aside and then topo surface actually it was okay we we were able to 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 make it but it wasn't like the the shape i want because uh, i may use it even this uh, i may use this topography even as the places where the people could sit even and watch the view um, so I decided to make it as uh, floors and then we, 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 we are just now able to put some material in here as a grass or something else and then I mean to render it. So let's go um, to see the steps. Um, let me just uh, save this file and then um, open a new file. Okay, so from file and then a new uh, project. Make it architectural template. I will now change the unit into centimeter and now I do have two levels in here and as you see from the uh, north elevation it's two levels and then the height is for um, 400 which is four meters um, I will go to massing and then show mass and then create a new mass in place mass and then say okay um, let me just say like this is the site I'm, I'm going to work uh, with okay so I will just uh, let's say just create some lines in some um, normal line from model line it doesn't matter now if it's a reference or model so i will just create something like this and then uh, like that for example okay and uh, of course directly i will go to this fillet fillet arc and then fillet these corners in order to uh, not to see this sharp let's say uh, if it's if it's okay of course you are able to make it with this um sharp edges but like for me i find it it's a bit cooler let's say or more realistic maybe or it's up to you you are able to keep it as it is or make it like with this fillet things so um this is the first step you are now able to go to your level two and then create or draw another shape or directly go to your uh, 3d select this shape and then say create shape uh, the first thing i will do directly i will just set this into 400 and then now what i will do is just select this upper face and let's say the steps are going to be something like this so i will just move it into here so even though i'm able now even to make it up upper or just uh, move it up or down or make it even then um, move it to, to the right side if you want this is uh, a way so now what we will do is just say finish mass go to your uh, north elevation select this level and then click ar for array make sure it's the last and then put it for example maybe 10 okay and then from here into this one what we will see is now he did create some floors for me of course it's in a black one let me even change the, the unit for you five is too much maybe 25 yes we can see that he did create levels for me i think there is something wrong wait let me just make sure ar 10 and now from here into here yes say yes so anyway he revit created some floor for me of course level one and two only only appear in here because um if i want to show these levels in here of course i have to go to plan view but this is not what i want what i want is just to go to my uh my mass and now I click on mass floor one and two i want to keep them or even though i am able to uh, let me just go from three to eleven and select them and check these and say yes 
So now what I do have is just the floor, the, the floor masses, let's say. I don't have the actual floor until now. So what I will do is just to go to my floors. And then floor by mass, uh, by face. Select like this. And then create floors. SD for shaded. And now go to your mass and site. And then unshow and hide the mass. If it's unable to, you can you could go to PV or VG, Visual Graphic, and click on M and then mass and say apply. Okay. So now what you do have is is this stepped uh, floors. Let's say you do you didn't like it. I mean, I would like to to change some something or some shapes in it. Let's say. Or you didn't like like it's a regular one let's say so you will just uh, go back I just click Ctrl Z click on your uh, mass and group click on this face and say edit profile let me say uh, like I will just maybe select these move them or just for example delete this one uh, bring this into Go to top, MV for move, move them back, and then uh, delete this, delete this one also, and now I will just fill it from this one, maybe into this one, let's say, or it's not like this, it's a bit uh, strange, maybe make it something like this, and now little fill it. This one and this one. Like this. Delete this part. Let me just make sure that they are connected. Move it back. Even though I will just even delete this one. And then again create something. Something like this. If I may like it now. I'm just trying to, to, to change the shape actually. You know. Let me say yes. And now what we do have is a different different floor, okay? So what I have to do is just to click on this floor, right click and then select on instance, visible in view, and then update to to face. Now click on this one EH for hide. Or just go to uh mass and unsight. Let's try it again. That didn't work, it's fine. I will just go to mass and then hide it. So this is the result. I do have now this step one. Uh, what what we will need maybe to do is just to change even the thickness of them. So I will go maybe make it 40. Say yes. Apply. Yes. I will just open a, a section. And look at it from the section. So as you see, we may need even to make, let's see, DI for dimension, another form, let's make it 45. So 45, apply, sorry, 45, okay. Okay, no problem, it's just saying there is an overlap, it's okay. So this is our floors, GD, smooth, go to shading and then show some shades. So this is it.